Hey guys, Sean here, and today I'm going to show you the basics of mouse navigation in Windows 7. Mostly, everything you do in Windows requires a left click or right click of the mouse. The left click is for selecting items and executing items, where the right click is more of a secondary option. To open or execute items on the desktop, just left click twice on any icon. Also, make sure when you double click that both clicks are close together, for example like this. If you would like to change your double click speed, then just left click once on the start menu in the bottom left, type in mouse in the search field, and then hit enter on the keyboard. This will pull up your mouse settings. Now to change the click speed, just move the bar in the middle to the right for faster or to the left for slower. And to test this out, click on the folder to the right of it. Next, if you would like to change how fast your cursor moves on the screen, then click the pointer options tab at the top. Move the bar to the far left for slower and to the right for faster. Then when you are done, just hit enter on the keyboard. Now one last thing to go over is when your mouse cursor changes to a finger icon, this means the object only needs a single click. And you'll find this with most of your online content. And there you have it, that's the basics of using a mouse in Windows 7. If you'd like to stay connected to this learning course, make sure to subscribe and feel free to rate and comment below. Also, if you have any requests, you can send them to requests at mahalo.com and thanks for watching.